Hi everyone. We are in the season of Lent. The season of Lent is not something that we all of us like to undergo because it is a time when we meditate upon the pain, loss, suffering and death of Jesus. Pain and suffering is not alien to human beings. They are not alien to you and to me. We are not exceptions. All of us know what pain is, what suffering is. Gautam Buddha centuries ago debated this question why do suffering come he asked himself why do people fall sick why do people experience pain why there is a sense of loss why people become old why people finally die and the reason that he found was it is because of the desire it is because of the ignorance it is because of the attachment to the transient things that we suffer loss we all undergo as i said suffering suffering disappointment setbacks loss are part and parcel of our life and it is easy to get discouraged even get bitter when we don't understand the things why this is happening to me why it is me why all these things are happening to me it is because we don't see the big picture that we are in that the life is a big picture just imagine a few pieces are given to you and asked you to put them together one piece isolated from the other do not make any sense they look funny they look they, they look senseless and so and so you 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 find yourself confused but when you put all these pieces together slowly slowly a bigger picture emerges you realize these pieces are not useless these pieces these pieces are not senseless but these pieces are part of the big picture take one piece away from the big picture and the picture would be incomplete similarly the painful experiences the loss death of the of, of, of the loved ones the failures that you experience the betrayal that you undergo all the things are senseless things for us they cause us lot of pain but when you see the big picture they will all make sense to you the problem we don't get the big picture is this because we are not at there to get there we need to undergo the process that is growth growth involves pain we always say pain is part of life we must undergo the we must go, go through the pain but i think we when while we go through the pain we should grow through the pain it is not just a passing through the painful experiences that make sense to us but growing but growing together but growing through this experiences that make sense to us all things are not good but we believe god can do good in everything all things are not good i repeat but god can do good in everything we must understand this god is there and god is not only in control of your life but god is also in control of the lives of your adversaries god is also in control of the life of every one of us god is also in control of whole universe he controls everything when you undergo the fire fire would definitely a painful experience but remember god controls the temperature god gives you the strength god gives you the feeling that you are not alone you will not be let down you will not you will not be finished because god almighty is with you and when you have this idea that this pain this suffering that you are undergoing you are not going to going alone but there is a god for you with you and he will be standing for you you know that it is passing reality as the good time has now have not lasted all time similarly the painful situation the painful time will not remain forever although the weeping lasts during night but in the morning comes joy when i walk through the valley of darkness under the shadow of death i fear no evil because my god goes before me every struggle is making you stronger every difficulty is growing you up every painful time even though you don't like it is developing something in you that can only be developed in tough times don't complain 
about the pain without the pain we could not reach the fullness of our destiny researchers some years ago did one experiment they took the, they took the bumble bees into the space to check the effects of the weightlessness these bees were so happy to float there they don't have to struggle there there was no pain they were just floating in the in the space they thought life is so good so nice just to enjoy the weightlessness and on the earth they had to fly they had to jump they had to uh, they get tired they had to regain their strength but in the space they didn't have any of this struggle for four days they enjoyed life on the fifth day something happened all of them died because they had ceased to learn the lesson of life that only in pain and struggle that our muscles go stronger it is when we lose something we become emerge as a victorious person because our muscles are becoming stronger we need to keep the right perspective in life difficulties are part of life every difficulty is meaningful only when the time comes we shall learn it keep right perspective and keep growing may god bless you